Welcome to Math Channel, Module 2, Lesson 1. Using the visibility rules for 4, 8, 11, and 12 to find the common factors of numbers. Problem Opener During the COVID-19 pandemic crisis, the DOH announces to hire 592 nurses to be assigned in different hospitals. The department head wants to divide them equally assigned to the hospitals. How many possible nurses in each hospital assigned if they will distribute into 4, 8, 11, or 12 hospitals? Would it be possible to distribute the nurses equally? If we are going to visualize the problem, it will look like the following. Nurses assigned into 4 hospitals. Nurses assigned into 8 hospitals. Nurses assigned into 11 hospitals. And nurses assigned into 12 hospitals. To solve the problem, you need to know if 4, 8, 11, or 12 are factors of 592. Or if 592 is divisible by 4, 8, 11, or 12. Let me show you first the solution. Divisibility rule for 4. 592 divided by 4. 5 divided by 4, we have 1. 1 times 4 is 4. 5 minus 4 equals 1. Bring down 9. 19 divided by 4 is 4. 4 times 4 equals 16. 19 minus 16 is 3. Bring down 2. 32 divided by 4 equals 8. 8 times 4 is 32. 32 minus 32 is 0. The answer is 148 nurses in each hospital. Therefore, 592 is divisible by 4. Divisibility rule for 4. A number is divisible by 4 if the last two digits of a number is divisible by 4. So we have 592 and the last two digits is 92. 92 divided by 4 equals 23. Since the last two digits of 592 is divisible by 4, therefore, 592 is divisible by 4. Divisibility rule for 4. Also, numbers ending in two zeros are divisible by 4. Examples are 100, 300, 2400, 5600, 87,200, and 49,700. Divisibility rule for 8. A number is divisible by 8 if the number formed by the last three digits is divisible by 8. So we have 592 divided by 8. 59 divided by 8 is 7. 7 times 8 is 56. 59 minus 56, we have 3. Bring down 2. 32 divided by 8 is 4. 4 times 8 equals 32. 32 minus 32 equals 0. The answer is 74 nurses in each hospital. Therefore, 592 is divisible by 8. Divisibility rule for 8. Also, a number ending in three zeros is also divisible by 8. Some examples are 1,000, 3,000, 24,000, 56,000, 87,000, and 49,000. Divisibility rule for 11. A number is divisible by 11 if the difference of the sums of alternative digits of a number is divisible by 11 or is equal to 0. We have 592 divided by 11. 
59 divided by 11 is 5. 5 times 11 is 55. 59 minus 55, we have 4. Bring down 2. 42 divided by 11 is 3. 3 times 11 is 33. 42 minus 33 equals 9. Since we have a remainder of 9, therefore, 592 is not divisible by 11. Here's how to test the divisibility for 11. Number 1. Group the alternative digits. Digits which are in odd places together and digits in even places together. Number 2. Take the sum of the digits of each group. Number 3. Find the difference of the sums. And lastly, if the difference is divisible by 11, then the original number is also divisible by 11. Let's have this example. 5,159. 5 and 5 are the digits in odd places. 1 and 9 are the digits in even places. So you have to add 5 plus 5 that is equal to 10. 1 plus 9 is also equal to 10. And then subtract 10 minus 10 equals 0. Since 0 is divisible by 11, therefore 5159 is divisible by 11. Divisibility rule for 12. 592 divided by 12. 59 divided by 12, we have 4. 4 times 12 is 48. 59 minus 48 equals 11. Bring down 2. 112 divided by 12 equals 9. 9 times 12 equals 108. 112 minus 108, we have 4. Since we have a remainder of 4, therefore, 592 is not divisible by 12. Divisibility rule for 12. A number is divisible by 12 if the number is both divisible by 3 and 4. So we have 592. 5 plus 9 plus 2 equals... 16. Since 16 is not divisible by 3, therefore, 592 is not divisible by 12. So, 592, the last two digits is 92. 92 divided by 4 equals 23. 592 is divisible by 4, but not divisible by 3. Therefore, 592 is not divisible by 12. Let's practice. True or false? 220 is divisible by 4. The answer is true because the last two digits, 20, is divisible by 4. True or false, 5,472 is divisible by 8. That is true because the last three digits, 472, is divisible by 8. 472 divided by 8 is equal to 59. True or false, 3,025 is divisible by 11. That is true because the difference of the sums of the alternate digits is equal to zero. In 3025, 3 plus 2 equals 5 for odd places. 0 plus 5 equals 5 for the digits in even places. The difference of the sums is 5 minus 5 equals 0. Therefore, 3025 is divisible by 11. True or false? 900 is divisible by 12. The answer is true because 900 is both divisible by 3 and 4. Divisibility rule for 3. In 900, 
9 plus 0 plus 0 equals 9. 9 is divisible by 3. Divisibility rule for 4. 900 ends in two zeros. Therefore, it is divisible by 4. Happy learning!